I believe our son Aaron is wasting his time being a social media influencer. Good Olympics out here. I don't think Aaron has a real <laughs> good grip on reality. I know and everybody else knows that I'm going to be a star. I just have the it factor. Everybody feels like they have the it factor. No. Aaron told us that he wants- I should have said, do you feel like you have the it factor? No. Drop out of college and become a full-time video influencer. Ain't no competition. I'm just having fun. Because if you look, I won. He's at a Division One school. Why would he want to do that? Yeah, doing that. Because like, it's funny. But what about real people with handicaps? Here. They can't even see it. <laughs> I've already had videos get. Bro, that's the thing. What blind person do you know is going on YouTube? Shout out to all the blind people. I have nothing against blind people. But what blind person do you know? Going on YouTube, typing in Aaron Brown blind person prank. Like, no one's doing that. So if a blind person know about this, the point I was getting at, if a blind person know about this and is offended by this, it's because you told them about it. Like, you didn't have to tell them. You you the reason they offended. I think it's stupid. He can't do <laughs> social media all the time because I'm not going to support that. I'm willing to do absolutely anything. Almost. To a See, that's the thing. I didn't say I'm willing to do anything. Really, they made me say that. I, was, I said something along the lines of, I would do almost anything to achieve my goals. Like, anything positive. Like, I wouldn't go rob a bank or nothing like that. Like, they tried to make it sound like I was just desperate for views or something. And I can get views. I've been getting views since I was 10 years old. My niche is prank and comedy. In one of my videos, I dressed up in an orange jumpsuit and I ran up to people in the park acting like I had just escaped from prison. <laughs> Aaron, I can't believe that. You know that's too dangerous. It's funny. It's a joke. That is not funny. Joke get you in trouble. Another one of my videos, I acted blind. I went. To... Bro, your dad was dead ass, man. Not a joke get you in trouble. Oh, he here. Right now, I'm in college on a track scholarship. I run a 200 and 400 meters. Next year, I plan on dropping out of college to pursue social media and content creation full time. And my parents really hate that idea. They just don't see the vision. The show is fake. My school is not an option. I just can't do it no more. I love school. You work so hard, and you telling me you just want to throw it all away? My dream is to be a video and social media influencer. Money, come here! Come right here right now! I know how to go viral. I've had 10,000 followers since the sixth grade. What's good, YouTube? Pause. I saw somebody comment, because I haven't watched the video yet, but I seen somebody come and said, you had 10,000 followers in sixth grade, and you still have 10,000 followers. You have no progress. No, I've been having over 10,000 followers since the sixth grade. You're going <laughs> to drop out of that and become a social media influencer. Yeah, I just prefer doing YouTube because, like, that's my passion. Once I graduate college, what am I going to do after that? Like, I don't want to work a job. You said, and I quote. I'm never working a job. I literally live under a bridge. I'm going to give the two of you some advice. If you enable him by supporting him when he has a college scholarship and is making his way through life and you make it possible for him to throw all of that away to make some videos to put up on the Internet when he hasn't got any more idea in a goose how to do it. I don't have any idea. I'm very smart. I do a lot of research. Try to make me seem dumb. Smarter than you, Dr. Phil. What to do? You are sabotaging him in the worst. Bro, and he act like he he's the one that, uh, like, he operates his social media. Like, bro, Dr. Phil is 90 years old. He probably don't even know how to use a phone. Like, even his show, there are, like, everybody doing everything for his show, and he just sits on the stage and talks. Like, you do absolutely nothing except get on the stage and talk and criticize when you don't know how to do nothing, you just a, a pawn just reading off a teleprompter every day. That's it. Him one. I'm more talented than Dr. Phil. Literally, he does nothing. Thin dime. Why don't you go ahead and finish your degree? What do y'all expect me to do after that? J-O-B, son. I refuse. I've seen some of his videos. I think they're dangerous and silly. This is not my bathtub.